There are two ways to get people to join in your safety program. You can either manipulate them or inspire them. And for years, we've been manipulating people to follow not safety, but rules. Look, fear, guilt, accident stories, gory images, even those daddy come home safe letters are all manipulations. You're trying to guilt your people to do better, but guilt doesn't last. It's, it's not a long-term solution. So what if instead of guilt and fear tactics, supervisors simply cared about each of their people, about helping them to deliver their best performance, and genuinely have heartfelt moments when they tell their crews, this work is so much easier with you here? What if safety meetings were just honest, caring conversations, where team members congratulated other team members, where the team looked forward to the safety meeting, and yes, where the meeting organizer didn't read his whole speech off the slides. What if safety people used their meetings like coaches of pro sports teams right before the big game, where the coach inspires the players to get their heads into it, where motivation runs high, where each member of the team looks out for and protects each other. That would be so much better for the frontline employees. But see, right now, you're not asking your people to be part of something. You're telling them to stop doing something. And the more you tell them to stop doing things, and you enforce rules, the more it feels like scolding. And you can't scold people into safety and make it stick. It's, it's hard to be on the receiving end of manipulations and scolding. You're not building a team. You're undermining it. See, inspiration is the antidote to manipulation. You can't care about your people's safety until you actually care about them. And you can't build trust until you trust them. And you can't get respect until you respect them. To improve your team's performance, you improve the performance of each member of the team. Teams improve when the individual players do. You build teamwork and participation through inspiration. You inspire your people to want to help them motivate themselves. Look, the job isn't enforcing rules. If you want lasting improvement, the job is about inspiring improvement positively. For more strategies on how to improve participation in your safety culture, read all about the M4 method in my book, People Work, The Human Touch in Workplace Safety. Available online worldwide in paperback, Kindle, and audiobook. On Amazon, iTunes, and Audible.